Hello, 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 friends and family, kings and queens. Terrell Richards in here, a.k.a. Coach T. Listen, today I'd like to talk to you about what I like to call the three R's. Reliable, resourceful, resilient. Reliable, resourceful, resilient. Today is part two of a four-part series where we tackle one of the three R's. If you have not done so already, please go back, take a look at part one of this four-part series. Today, we want to tackle the word reliable, the word reliable and how it relates to you, how it relates to you, my lifelong learners. Yes, I'm talking to you. When I think about the word reliable, I think one name comes to mind, one person, mom. Mom is reliable, without a doubt. Mom tells you for breakfast we're going to have pancakes and eggs. You know what? No need to ask what's for breakfast. Mom is reliable. If mom tells you after work tomorrow she's stopping at the market, she'll be home a little later, don't expect mom home at 3 or 3.30 her usual time. She'll be home a little later. She is reliable. But let me tell you, today's message is not about mom. Today's message is not about mom. To my, today's message is about you and how you can be reliable. Today, I'm gonna to help you understand and give you some tips on how you can become reliable. If the question was asked to your mom, your dad, your brother, your sister, your friends, are you reliable, what would they say? What would they say? So here's the big question. Are you reliable? I'm talking to you right now, my lifelong learners. Are you reliable? See, to be reliable, you have to be disciplined. Do you get up in the morning and get ready for school without someone nudging you saying, hey, get up, it's time for school? Do you get your chores done without being asked, hey, did you take out the trash? Did you wash the dishes? Did you clean your room? Did you get your homework assignments done and completed and, and in on time? without someone asking, is your homework done? If you answer no to any or all of these questions, you may not be reliable. See, to be reliable, you have to be disciplined. And I'm gonna give you some tips on how you can be reliable. Pay close attention to this. I'm gonna give you these tips. Number one, write down why you wanna be reliable and what it is you're committing to. Number two, review your commitment daily in the morning and in the evening. Number three, give yourself some kind of reminders on your commitments. Number four, practice positive affirmations every day. And finally, number five, remember what impact it will have the impact it's going to make. These are the tools, the tips that you need to become reliable. See, too often in society, we get caught up into what's the next best thing, what's the latest fad, and we don't lead a structured daily life. This game plan right here, this game plan, Add some structure to your daily events. Ultimately, you will become reliable. Well, my lifelong learners, that's all I have for today. My name is Terrell Richard Sr., a.k.a. Coach T. And until the next time, I want you to be reliable. And I'm out.